What's up guys, I'm Rustin from RossmoreTech.com and this is another tutorial in Swift programming. Now in this class I'm going to talk about comments. So let's get started. So this is the code we used in our last class. So in all programming languages you, there are ways to write comments, footnotes, so that you can keep yourself up to date or if other people are going to work on your program they will be up to date. And uh, you won't forget what, whatever a line of program does. So there are a couple ways you can write a comment. The first way is uh, using two forward slashes. The two forward slashes, right, uh, tells the program that everything after these two forward slashes on this one line here is a comment. So only after this two forward slashes and on this same line here is a comment. If we write something under here, it's no longer a comment. And uh, the computer won't execute it. It'll just, uh, it'll know it's a comment and not execute it. So let's test it out. I'm going to hit space after this two forward slashes. I'm going to type in this is a comment, right? So if I try to write something underneath here, as you can see, it's it's no longer green. And if I continue writing up here, it turns green because it's a comment. Now, again, comments normally are green. Most like editors will keep comments green. So there's another way to write a comment. Let's say you want to write a comment that's more th more than one line. And it's easy. You all you have to do is type in forward slash or press forward slash uh, this hyphen or star. Then uh, wherever you want to end the comment, you type in uh, hyphen forward slash again. So any anything between these two lines of code here is a comment. So we could write as many lines of code as we want. So I could write you know just gibberish all the right way through. Right, this is all gibberish here. Anything uh, between these two, the computer recognizes it as a comment, and you could have as many lines as you want. If you're a programmer, you should always keep comments, not just for yourself. You got to think about, you know, if other people are going to try to pick up where you left off or edit your program, you need to keep comments. No one's perfect. Like you could write a million lines of code in one day and know exactly what each line of code is. A week later, you're probably going to forget. That's the way it works. So comments are really important. All right, so that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys like this video, please give me a like. If you want more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. I'm Rustin from RossmoreTech.com, and thanks for watching.